Morning YouTube. We have a an accident here in uh, city of Compton where a gentleman was trying to make a U-turn and ended up uh, hitting a whole bunch of vehicles. Uh, he had a, a his box truck on top of his uh, his trailer here, I guess just for transport and uh, I'm not sure if he was lost or disoriented. I was making his turn, which is relatively wide, but he didn't notice that his, uh, his overhang was, uh, was way out and ended up hitting, uh, I believe, five to six cars here. I'll show you the damage pretty soon, but um, he, uh, he creamed a lot of cars. That spider here helping me out. So the game plan originally was, uh, yeah. Oh, nice, look at it. Spider, nice and clean. <laughs> oh, all fitted? Fitted? Yeah. Nice. No more homeless. Yeah, no more homeless. <laughs> we always make this joke about Spider, you know, sometimes we see him dirty and uh, we're saying he's homeless. Obviously he's not, but he made a point to, uh, to show that uh, he was clean today. The guy was gonna go cruising, not anymore. Oh man. You know, it messed up his day, huh? Mm -hmm. It messed up his day. Oh yeah. That sucks. He even fight other people. Shh. So, like I was saying, I uh, ended up. Uh, <laughs> Hitting a couple of vehicles there and uh, completely destroy that one. I'm not sure if you could see that one over there, that Honda. Oh man, I messed up that guy's day. But uh, as far as this box truck, um, the original game plan was just to lift it off from the front and let it roll back. But um, we don't want it to uh, to slam down and create a more damage to that uh, to that vehicle to that box truck I should say so I'm just gonna go ahead and put my spreader bars to the front and the rear and just completely lift the whole thing off and set it back down on the floor so as you can see here this, uh, this thing landed right on the bed when he hit it and uh, it dragged it right over the strap obviously I'm gonna have to take off before I lift it. And that's off. And uh, Suzu NPR HDs. Obviously it's empty. Well we'll go ahead and lift it off. I'll connect here to this uh maybe uh, a strap here and go up. another vehicle right there oh man we hit a lot of vehicles I think the other ones are already gone but for the most part you guys are always making fun of my uh my screwdriver so I ended up buying this this little stool there you go much better hey I put my coffee cup in the wheel where go wherever it's going where'd you put it at in the wheel okay. hopefully it doesn't spill huh no no it's not it's empty oh well, it's empty now Oh, he already bent the box right there. What? I said he already bent the box. Oh, yeah, right hey, he's concerned about the box, but he, he creamed that box. So the customer was, I mean, uh, the, the truck driver 
like I said, you know, we don't want to make his day any worse, but he was concerned about the box, but you could see right there that he, he bent that box already. Obviously, we're not going to go ahead and completely destroy it just because, you know, which uh, obviously some other companies don't care. They just run straps through whatever and just cream everything. That's not right. I'm all here at Pepe's. But uh, we definitely need to... Uh, We can salvage some some portion of this. Oh, you can see here. You hit this hard. What happened? Are oh, you locked it already? Reel reel? Yeah, each one. And since my boom head will be right in the center, it's gonna do this.
for this one I always go to my choice here my platinum smooth 30,000 in a vertical recently uh, Thad and Susan sent me some uh, 40,000 pounders they saw uh, our excavator video and uh, Thad very generously uh, gifted me some 40,000s in a vertical which are really nice and uh, obviously we're always very grateful to Susan and Thad for uh, always uh, providing excellent service yeah I know <laughs> so this goes in the other side what happened this one goes in the other side this was gonna yeah this side's gonna go on the other side Huh? I won't even be close to the wire because my boom head will be there in the center of the box oh, okay. truck. Yeah, so it's gonna be like this. Oh, right. So as I pull in, I'll just create a bit, a little bit of tension. Yeah. And then I'll boom up little by little. Oh, all right. Good that little yeah, and that one I'm even gonna be close to it. I'll be closer to probably that one, yeah. but my boom head will be in the middle. I just need to be super high. Yeah. Right. Just checking. Yeah, I know. He didn't realize how long his overhand was, huh? It just creamed all the cars. Well, no. Well, you knew. Yeah? But it's stupid. He just kept doing, kept going? Hey, you can't do this. It's so short. It is very short. Just like me, trying to turn around with a truck and trailer in your tow truck. You can't do this. That's hard, huh? That's fine right there, spider. It is. Size spider, I just need enough uh, height to uh to be able to put my uh, my spreader bars directly overhead, have enough line so by the time that I pull. You gotta remember some of these straps, they have some stretch, which I believe is about 15% stretch. So they're gonna stretch just a, a tiny bit. And it's always important to uh, make sure you compensate by that for that. So these rear ones, Obviously connect to the back. So the this gray one right here, yeah. it's gonna connect to the wheel right here, oh, okay. and the other one's gonna connect to that wheel. This one up here is gonna connect to the front. Yeah, I'll give you the straps right now. We'll connect them here, yeah. right through the wheel. I'll put some wood here just to create a little bit of. Uh, of separation and then I'll put my angle iron here oh, okay. that way to spread the load that way I don't crush this as much yeah, yeah these bad boys right here little baby shot the little baby uh slings
Yeah, see right here? Yeah. And then up there, I'll connect it with the shackle. See? I'll put angle iron here. Uh, see that? So this will go here. So actually, it's a smaller, so we'll connect this one here. We'll keep the wider throat here. Put that one through. Sass, and then scroll this one down. Yeah. All right. Okay. And then we'll put the angle irons at the end when I put pressure on it. Yeah, but you don't have to put wood. Just put that. The angle iron? Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. This is going to go here. Uh, I guess so. Yeah, there's, no, there's no point of it. Right. It's not flush with this. Yeah, you're right. Okay. We'll do that. The other one goes here. There it is. And another 12 ton shackle. 12.5. Oh, I'll put an angle iron. I need to spread the, the pressure across the whole rail. Uh, let me get my stool. I need these as well. Here. I want the wider part. See this, this portion here, and that. And I'll put the smaller footprint on this one. Cool. Okay. And then obviously these have these protectors here. These protectors here protect against the lining of the of the rim. There, very resilient. So coupled with this uh, resin plus this. It's going to protect it very well. Sure. Okay, that's one of them. See, and this will go here. So by the time this goes up, pass. See that? Yeah. Cool. Like cool. right that? Like one this? Off. Like, well, it's going to be flat. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Go ahead. Hold it? Yeah, I got You're it. You're going to have to hold this one too. It's all right. Got it? Yeah. Did you get the other angle iron for that side? Oh, okay. Ready? Yeah. You have tension? Yeah. Okay. Good? That's good. Yeah. Okay. I wonder if we should put something under here. It's a little tight, no? No. Let me see. No, you're okay. Yeah? I wonder if it will cut that. It's a little sharp. No, not this. No way. And so let, me, let me put something just in case. I'll, gi I'll give you the little rubbers. Yeah, we'll put one of these right there. I'm gonna lower it a little bit, okay? Right there? A little bit more? Good? Okay. Oh, that's good, yeah. Actually, oh, yeah, very. Yeah. Okay. Grab the other side. I'm gonna pull it.
Ready? Ah! Oh. Right there? Okay, let's get it. Come this way? Uh, I can't move the boom head anymore because of the cable. I'll, I'll, I'll grab something right now. Right there. All right. Let me put some tension on it and see where it goes. Yeah. That way we could adjust from there. Didn't you put a little one of those plastic ones in? Where? Here? Yeah. I can put one. Yeah. That way it doesn't scratch it. Pick it one. I'm going to use one with the other side. Yeah, it's not going to scratch it. These protectors here, just so it doesn't scratch it, you know. Thank you, bro, for your help. No, no worries. I think you're okay here. I can put this here, no? Uh, it's not going to do anything. Well, it's okay. Once this wheel turns, it's going to change the angle. Yeah. So I would probably put it here. Right there. We'll put it this way. That way it contours. Right there. There it is. See? So we're almost ready to lift off. So we're ready to go. Oh, I forgot the, my free spools. Tell him to hold on, spider.
Go ahead and move it forward. We got it airborne now. Now to rotate forward just to get it in line. With the high winds, I'm ensuring that uh, it doesn't spin. Hey, time to go forward. He wants to put it on his bed? Okay, Tom, hold on. Yeah, let me get some air. Now he wants me to put it on his bed, which makes his job a lot easier. Right there, stop. I didn't wait. You need to come back, no, a little bit? Yeah. That's fine. We'll get it close and then he could adjust from there. How, how close do you want it? You let me know. Just one more. Just one more. Here, here. Just one second.
The tires are gonna go where? The real wheels in the back right here. Right there? Okay. Okay, go ahead and back up then. Go ahead and back up a little bit. Watch, you'll see, hold on. I know, I'm just doing. Yeah, you're gonna have to back up a little bit. All right. Okay? I'll back up when those wheels are right here, okay? Quiere las llantas ahí el güey. Let me know when. Right there? El otro lado. Ahí está el otro de una vez, ¿no? Spider. Ok, ya. Yeah, I'll lift it up. Ah? Watch. Ah, no, I'll calculate right now on the computer, ¿ok? I'm just a driver. My friend can't help, but it's not my friend. And I will pay for everything. Who's gonna pay for everything? I will pay right now, but I will pay for my pocket. Oh, okay. It's not company. I'm all the driver. Yeah, I know. Just help me. Oh, we go by CHP rate, man. I don't. I don't make the prices. They make the prices. I'm saying just stack like going. If you can't help me, just yeah. Well, I'll I'll, I'll, I'll mess with Thomas. Yeah. Ah, short people problems. Ah, what a day to be windy, huh? I know. That was sick, bro. Oh, you like it? Thanks, yeah. man. <laughs> All for the YouTube channel, huh? All for the YouTube. Well, hell yeah. yeah. We use it for two purposes. So we use it obviously for the YouTube. 
but then also for insurance purposes and everything because uh sometimes we get when we lift them they're like oh you know like say oh you know you damaged that thing and i'm like no see on the video it proves it well, especially with this guy who yeah he has an input for everything if you get him on video doing that yeah no i have it <laughs> never all right <laughs> I mean, that sucks, you know, like, we all have bad days, you know, we all, you know, no, but he forgot about his overhang, you know, and that's what, I'm sure that's what creamed all those cars. Well, yeah, but he, he got too close, bro. Oh, okay. See? He was probably on that lane, huh? Yeah, yeah. Had he been in the first thing, he probably wouldn't have hit him. No, 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 because you're going to go here. Yeah. There was not enough room. Oh, man, that sucks. No matter what, it was not enough room for him to turn. Now with this overhang. Yeah, with that overhand. Yeah, no, yeah. he needs to go over there and make a turn somewhere. Pero el huevón trabaja doble. That's true. Yeah. Right? Yeah. yeah. Well, we're all done here, guys. I'm just going to put away my truck. Uh, I uh, ended up putting the the box truck right on the customer's bed so he could strap it back down, make it easier for him rather than drive it up. So this guy is pretty much uh, all set to go. He put his straps in there. Like I said, it's, it's unfortunate, you know, it happens to everybody, it happens to, on, you know, even on our best days, you know, we can have accidents. But, uh, you know, sometimes our being in a rush, you know, we end up uh, destroying stuff. Well guys, uh, this is it from uh, Compton, uh, California. We'll see you on the next one, guys. Stay safe. Peace. Peace out.